Constitutional Convention a la Shmup. After winning the Revolutionary War, early Americans feared that the U.S. could turn into a monarchy. That is, a country run by a big fat dictator called a king, just like the one we had fought a war to free ourselves from. Our central government was very weak. People had different ideas about how things should be run. Like what power would rest with the states and what power would lie with the federal government. So because our forefathers wanted this new nation of theirs to go swimmingly, all of the smart and important people were called together to write a constitution. This document set forth the fundamental rights and core principles of our nation, and it was written in really pretty cursive. For an 18th century document, it's pretty amazing how relevant the Constitution remains today. Well, except for that part about the importance of forming militias, and the reference to African Americans being three-fifths of a person, and, well, you get the picture. So, have we come a long way? Are we ready for a new constitutional convention? Should we once again call upon the best and brightest in our nation to produce a document that states the principles that will guide our nation? Okay, homework time. It's your job to pick the participants for this all-important gathering. Who makes the cut? Your favorite teacher? Stephen Hawking? Chuck Norris? Think about the qualities you want in your representatives. What's really important? A big brain? A kind heart? A hot bod? Do you want a smorgasbord, a policeman here, a construction worker there? Or are you better off with just the most effective leaders? Whether that's all politicians, all scientists, or you and your nine closest friends. Ah! Who would be invited to attend your constitutional convention? Shmup amongst yourselves, let us know. <laughs>